What's up, nerds? It's Matt and Kyle. This is the 2 1 bracket here, and I'm playing against Merfolk again. Well, I have to take Pilgrimage because I can't deal with Pilgrimage. But I'm calling it. Either that draw or the next draw will be a Pilgrimage. We will have to wait and find out. Uh, pass. The reason why I was talking about this. Draw. Yeah. Uh, Sanctum. Mm -hmm. Tap a green. So no discount. The one you gave me today. And this will be a pilgrimage. Not uh, quite. But we will put this one in the graveyard to see if the next one's a pilgrimage. I don't know next if turn. the camera is gonna show it very well. Yeah. No, it just like keeps coming back over and over again. It's uh. Not gonna focus. Yeah. Of course not. No. The top is crimped from a promo pack. Oh, there you go. I think you can see it there. So I opened it and I was like, oh. I'm never going to do anything with this, but I know someone who plays this card. Anyways, you put that in the graveyard. Yeah, cure flowers to the graveyard, on the field, and that will be my turn. Anything. Pass. Mm. Not only is it Death Touch and Life Wing, right? it is mm -hmm. also a butt. <laughs> yep, bigger booty. Uh, well, the thing we say about booties yeah. is Hex <laughs> Catcher gets through it. <laughs> I think. Do we? Do we slow it with an Elite? I think we're gonna, we'll try it. Let's we'll oh, see if you like, want to. Like, Sorry, we'll, yeah. we'll see if you want to trade it. We'll tap with a 3 thing. I'll, I'll just take so. it for now. Okay. I, uh, and then I will That's actually just weird. It's like I'm playing a normal deck for the Ah, here, there he is. I'll attack. I'll we do. So, you'll need to set that. I want to build some more. I want to build some Okay. Uh, no, no, he's shot myself. No, he's 16. We will tap two for the elite. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then it's no disco. And then we're going to do actually a biomancer. Oh, that's what I put. And we will trigger put the counter onto the. If you're gonna wipe it, you're gonna wipe it. We'll put it here so we can do something if we need to, and then we'll go to combat. Oh, sorry, yes, trigger, I have to loop. Go to combat, swing, three again. Alright, I'll trade. Okay. It makes me think the board of the white Passer. To be fair, I do have. Right. Like a nice catcher, so. Alright, I'll pass. Uh, on time. Alright, well, start. Drop it. Okay, now, dude. See ya. We'll see the whale large. Hmm, we're gonna do what I should never do overcommit. Oh. So, no take out? Mm hmm. Uh, two triggers. So, we'll start, we'll put a copter. Um, I guess we'll leave the copter on top, and we will put the 1-1 one, one counter onto... Feels weird. Put it on the hex catcher. Okay. Uh, two mana. Hex catcher? Uh, and we're gonna go ahead and I guess this time we'll just put it on the elite themselves. Um, I'm gonna go to combat, and just swing the... 4-4. Four, four. Um, draw a card. It's 4. Yeah. Gain 2. Die. Gain 2. And that'll be my turn. I know. There's a bunch. Yeah, every desk has one. They're all just the really small ones, so they're using this. Oh, I didn't know. Yeah, once you start looking at them, there's a whole bunch where you're like, it just can't throw it in a way? It's just like paper only? It's just recycling? Yeah. 
No card. I am hellbent. Ooh, there wasn't a bent. Not many. Let's kill your view. Ouch. Well, let's so shuffle back in then. And it's a basic, correct? Yes. Correct. We will be grabbing a island. See, now you're going to shuffle the deck up again, then the pilgrim is going to be on top, probably. <laughs> Mutable is land for turn. Yep. Um, so I think we just keep being pedal to metal and be aggro. We'll go ahead and plunge everything. Yeah. We'll bond it by the big hex catcher. Okay. Of course, the one I can't be countered. Uh, one, two, three, uh, four, five. So yeah, three, four, six. Because he gets the one one from there. Oh, yep. Here. Yep. So go to eleven. See, it's unfortunate Mutable enters as a land and not a Merfolk. Daytime. We will eat Hex Capture. Actually, uh, Follower. Probably a good call. did say something about it, so copter. I shuffled it away. <laughs> no, you didn't. <laughs> it was too deep. It was, just wasn't on top anymore. We will man land it up. Mm -hmm. um, and then... I feel like you'd still probably take that. But I mean, I gotta keep going, so we're just gonna swing for six. That is a 3-3? Three, three. Yeah, they're both 3-3s. Three, I'll, I'll block them. Yeah. Sure. That's, that's why, Mike, you're going to trade yeah. one of them for sure. It's probably going to be really get a lot of, uh, you know, out of Yeah, game. yeah. so you'll take the 3. So I'm at 9. And then I'll pass her. That's what I'm trying to remember what it was. I'm like, yeah, I think it's night now. I don't know how much it's going to matter. I, I, well, yeah, I didn't cast this one. So. Um, turning him up. Mm -hmm. uh, crewing. Mm -hmm. Go to combat. Yes. Push. How dare you push out? Um... Go to combat. Mm -hmm. Swing 3-3. Three, three. You have one card in hand? Yes. Two mana open, one card in hand. Is it the third hex catcher? Is it the third hex catcher? I'll block. I'll tell you right now. I get to draw three hex catchers tonight. That's right? Yeah. Um, but, because you love killing my things, and that's coming back. <laughs> I'll pass the turn. turn. <laughs> So what is it? I have to sacrifice. I'm gonna lose four life and a creature or okay. Yeah. I guess I don't have to do anything there. You don't it's, have to come. Yeah. 
Well, I'm saying you're, you're, ta- you're out of cards in hand too, right? Right. So yeah. I would draw. So I'll sacrifice a creature and take four, and you'll draw through two. Oh. Right. Yeah, I draw two. You take four. Yeah. So fourteen. I draw. I know it's not good for you to draw, but me wiping my own board is probably worse. So while I don't get three of the uh, hex catchers, I do generally see like all four mutavolts. Yep. Um, okay. Go to combat swing three. Yep. Go six. Pass turn. I'm going to pay one. I'll turn him into a, a creature. I'll sack the Mutavolt as the creature, and I'll take four, go to seven, and you can drop two. Shieldreds. Oh Jesus! I was like, literally all yeah. land. I'm like, I'm sitting here like you've drawn so many. There's I drew no way fu- I'm gonna. I drew two cards off of the first invoke and two off of the next invoke. Yeah, and there were four. And, lands. and between those four and the one I drew for my turn was the second invoke, and that was it. And then I just topped deck to Thossies. Yeah. <laughs> like, um, if people don't you, like, people don't believe me when I say this. This is my draws. All this, these were my draws. All it would have taken was any piece of removal. Yeah. And or a shieldred, and the game was over. Yeah. Like, you would just remove another creature. I, I would, there's another elite. I mean, yeah, I would have... There's a pilgrimage finally after, like, four more deep, so... Unreal. Happens so consistently. <laughs> that was 13 lands to nine cards. And yes, I mean, I fetched one, one off of Field of Yeah, Rome. but that, that just exchanges itself, so I mean, right. yeah. So you can say I drew 12, 12 lands to nine cards. And three or four in your opener. Uh, five, I think, was oh, my geez. opener. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I mean, it was ridiculous. Like I said, though, to be fair, if you don't keep the five, what's going to happen is you're going to not draw our land all game. Right. But if you keep the five, you're going to flip. Sideboard stage from the last round. I find it amazing that of the eight games that Murphy played, three different people here got matched up against both of them. Yeah. Tim got round one, two. You and Rick both got three, four. To be fair, Rick didn't have to be. He didn't play. Yeah. Which I don't blame him for. It's an obvious split. Doesn't even 
doesn't matter who's favored. Yeah. And an hour of your time is not worth two That's minutes That's exactly, tracks. yeah. I will play first. Maybe I should just run 20 lands in this deck, even though it curves at 5. <laughs> just need 20 lands and a bunch of treasure production. I mean, if I'm pulling 5 lands out, I can put in 5 treasure cards. Exactly. Perfect. I mean, I put candy trails back in this week, because it's just like, I need the Something. early scry just to be able to bottom 2 lands that I don't want. <laughs> like, that's literally, like, the first one I played against Garrison, I think, was Scry 2. Look at two lands, bottom both. You're like, no, this is not a good card. Okay. It shouldn't be in the deck. I run it because I'm cursed. Right. <laughs> I'm keeping. Swap. Okay. Right. We will uh, hurt myself for two with a breeding pool. Go to 18. And then I will play my second favorite one drop, a Benthic Biomancer. Yes. Yeah. Mm, I'll just push it now. Yeah, you get pushed. Mutable is land for turn. <laughs> so many options, and I don't know what to do. I mean, you don't have pilgrimage. Oh, it's just not as good because I killed the wonder up. Yeah, not being able to tap anything right away is a real painful thing. Yeah. Can't harm the cards that you get in our land and play something and he's mutable either, so we're gonna try. Thankfully, I would have made a bunch, but. Yeah. We'll try to really, really mean deeper lead. I'll just push it. That was the other thing, so I'm like, I'm 90% sure that whatever gets played is gonna get pushed. Part of me is just feeling like you kept a hand of like pure removal. I mean, that's, <laughs> in theory, that's, like, most of the deck will hit a poker, uh, deep root, yeah, yeah. Pilgrimage, yes, we'll hit Pilgrimage. Uh, drain, chest. one, yeah. Draw. Whoa. It doesn't make me feel good. Sure. Three pushes? Yeah. <laughs> Eat it. Yeah. 19, 12, <laughs> take three. You're right. Good enough. Very right. Pass. Finally. Woo woo. Yeah. Well, we're going to play this first. Tapagreen. Shaper Sanctuary. Whenever a creature I control becomes part of a spell or ability and opponent controls, I may draw a card. Would have been amazing three fatal pushes ago. And the other two is for Hex Catcher. Sure. Faster. Um, yep. Yeah. I will draw a card. Lose four. Go to 15. Go to my turn. Yeah. Gotta get damages. I can't 
question. Counter unless sure. you pay one? Sure. I'll let it counter. Okay. Is it only oh, hit creatures or permits? Creatures? Okay. Um, exile the dude. Eight, put you to five. Yeah. Meet it. Did I not write? I didn't write something. Oh, I didn't write down my life loss from the draw. Let's put me to six. Yeah. Uh, pass. Had I hit the land like four turns ago? Yeah. I didn't even realize you had no green that whole time. I had green the whole time. Oh. The problem is I only had two mana, and every card in my hand is two. Gotcha. Oh, except for this. So I'm like, I need one to play yeah. th something that's Double three. spell, yeah. Um, and I I mean, yeah, you just got it at this point. There's no way I'm going to get out of this, but... I had it was just all gas, but yeah. the three fatal pushes without hitting a sec a third land just broke me. Yeah. Game three. Land, land, land. I do what I, I did. What I do best. Yep. Clump the lands together. Just wasn't my deck for once. Well, like I said this this matchup is exclusively right. who gets yeah. mana screwed worse. Yep. <laughs> You didn't flood, I got nothing. To be fair, you actually probably were borderline flooding. You um, had, you, I don't think you missed I, a land drop. I didn't miss a land drop. Oh, dear God. But since you weren't double spelling, I was fine. Yeah. I don't know how this happened. Oh. The sl they, yeah, they were smushed the wrong way. And thankfully, you pretty much know the whole deck list, so I don't care. I think I do have a post it underneath the hook. I don't know if it's the most up to date, but most, it yeah. might be. Oh, there we go. I was like shuffling, like, this feels really weird. I don't know why. I looked out. Mm -hmm. chance against him because he can go wide really fast. Right. And his board his board's fairly protected against wipes when it's just not even creatures but enchantments and whatnot. Yeah. Fair adverse at that point is a three drop, right? Yeah. Yeah. So you're basically like saying that I'm going to take good. beats for <laughs> potentially yeah. three four, turns, yeah, you'll and have, then burn myself. Yeah. <laughs> It'll be turn four before I do anything, and you'll be hurting yourself for three after yeah. taking yeah. who knows how many face beats. Yep. Yeah, that's understandable. You know, I haven't even been able to get a token out yet against you. That's rude. You thought she's one away, and then you... Well, then I just didn't get out. Yeah. I, the best part is who had top deck on turn one, the second pilgrimage, and I'm like, oh, I don't have to worry about Thoughtseize anymore. I'll play creatures out first, because you're going to those away, and then push, push, push. Yeah. Alright, seven. All right. Look, you got eaten up by dinos? I got we'll destroyed keep. all four games. Oof. Right? Yeah. Uh, Sanctum? Into a Shaper Sanctuary, yeah. Now we can do something about those turn two, one, two, three pushes. Nice. You get to cast three What about that thought season, though? Uh, it does not target my creatures, so uh, you can pick which one of those two you want. Is that the crimped one? Yeah. You can have the crimped one. Okay, we'll, we'll put this one in the bin. Yeah. And then pass. Okay. 
This is why I said the hand was probably not a good one because it was three one drops, but I'm like, I have the card that lets me protect my creatures and I have three, two scouts. I'm gonna see so many cards. So we're gonna start with a land. No, uh, sorry, no, we're gonna go with the mutable. Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna tap the green, play the Cenote Scout. <laughs> we will explore, deep relief, we'll leave, we'll put and the then, one one counter here. Yeah. Passenger. Cast it. Mm -hmm. Pass. Take two, yep. Draw. Um, that's all your turn. Nothing matters because you can now draw. Kill me. Tapped. Tap two. Deep early. Mm -hmm. Combat. So swing two. Okay. 16. Faster. One card. Two. I got to land high window. Oh, okay. Yep, yep. So, okay. Draw. Thank you. God, I don't think I'd be enough to kill me off the ice. Uh, <laughs> yeah. this one. So, we're going to draw a card. I lose one. Yep. So, three, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Right. I'll pass. Okay. That will. Yeah. Keeping the pushing system play something better. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know it was coming. Oh, I should do this too. The moment you blew it up, I, I top deck it. I know. Cure's follower, Cynic. Um, ETB will put a 1 1 counter onto himself. Uh, combat? Yeah. Swing both. Four trigger, make a merfolk. Where's my tokens? I'll move them over here. And then put a one more counter. We'll put this one onto this this Sunday scout, so it will be five all together. Yeah, sure. And then we'll pass her. I'm gonna push the follow. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's what I did. Yep. Pass. 18. Woo woo. Yep. Draw. I just keep up the theme. Trigger, we'll put that here. So go to combat, we'll swing the 4 4, trigger, make another 1 1, turn the 4 4 into a 5 5, so it's actually trade both children. Would you wipe a trade, sir? One children for a cenote scout. A beefy cenote scout, though. The second game it worked. It worked barely. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That's, that, well, that's, that's the no. point. I'll go to five. Okay. Uh, sure. If you want right. to figure five. Because right. I'm really hoping this is Pat there. Yeah, if you would have played. No. Play no hard other cards? Yeah. But I do get you two. Yeah, if you would have survived one. Yes. Two. Yeah, yeah right there. there. Probably, probably three, because it would have been probably best to get kill. I will discard card. We will pay the one. Turn the meeple. Combat. Flunge the team. Trigger. Make one more merfolk. With a counter. We'll put the counter on the mutable to be cool. Uh, the two largest are these two. Uh, yes, yeah, so 3-3, three, 5-5, three, five, five, and then a 2-2, two, 2-2, two, 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 and then 4. So it's going to be 2, 4, 6 total power here, and then, yeah, those two. Okay, so if I block like this, I'm going to 1 as is, unless that's Hex Catcher. It is not Hex Catcher. Is that correct? Um, so yeah, you, you're going to live. Um, this is more of a do I... Care about nope. So we'll play that anyway. So yeah, we're good. Okay. So, so we trade. Trades. Yep. I go to one. Yep. And then you'll go ahead and hope for the uh, board wipe. Nope. You know you're both. I mean, it doesn't do. It doesn't. It yeah. Doesn't, and shoulder doesn't do anything either. Right. Yeah. 
I had two rapid hybridization, so the question was, do I want to try and save one of my creatures because I could have just killed yours, but it's like, trading them doesn't really matter, and keeping the rapid hybridization back in case another shield came down okay. may have been more important, but... Okay, I don't want to get a dice stick and make it more. Yeah, shapers is. But yeah, I mean, at that point, another shielder doesn't do anything for me. Right. It's just a blocker. I'm dead on board. Because, uh, yeah, I think the, I had the pilgrimage got there, so. You want to see what I'm carrying? Had the invoke been a turn earlier? I needed the invoke to happen basically when you played the yeah. pilgrimage. Once that sticks around, it, it creates too much incremental advantage. And would I ever see in in four? Well, I guess I only played three sideboarded games against Merfolk. Would I ever draw a board wipe? <laughs> no. no. Yeah, I say like, this is my sideboard this time against you because I'm like, you know what? I need to be able to redraw. And like, if you put Shielder down, that's sometimes the only way I can get by you. It's just be like, all right, well, I'm gonna go with a big old beefy unblockable and. Yeah. Took out the miscaller and two shooners. 